It is time to drop the puck on the Stanley Cup playoffs here on EA Sports. A lot of bounce on both blue lines here, and we are about set to drop the puck here at center. in play. We're still in the early stages of this period. Still no score in this one. And sneaks in and grabs possession. They gain the offensive zone from the middle. Sends the pass over. Gets a piece of it to keep it out. What a fantastic save from a high danger scoring area, James. And I mean, he's bailing his team out. They have to do a better job of protecting the middle of the ice. The Mariners have it in the offensive zone. Some solid defensive work in their own end with the poke check. Quick feed to Gillespie. Stopped by the goaltender getting a piece of that one. Broken up by Noel. Handles the pass at center. Here we go, pucks in deep. Adirondacks got it in the road. There's the whistle. Let's get the call for the officials. Sometimes it's just a product of keeping your feet moving. And when you reach and you take your opponent's feet out, you're going to get the two minutes for tripping. Adirondacks man advantage unit will take to the ice for the first time tonight. For the scoreless game, James, an opportunity to go up by one. They'll want to gain possession right off the draw and set the tempo. Huge steal in his own end. Good clearing attempt to breathe. The Thunder have possession along the boards. From center, they get into the attacking area. Dumps it into the O-zone. Adirondacks got the puck in the defensive end. Moves it to Harper. Moves it to the middle. And he shuts down a great scoring chance there. They'll get set to drop the puck as this power play continues. Play resumes as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Oh, gets a paddle on it. What a stop by Starrett. It's amazing to me how he always looks like he's in the right position because he tracks and reads the play so well. And this time he gets in front of the puck that's right in the middle of the ice as the shooter's got a dangerous opportunity. Smith won the faceoff here in the offensive zone. The Mariners look to start the transition game. Big hit and that frees up possession. Adirondacks got a hold of the puck. Quick pass to Skio. Steps across the blue line. Knocks the puck loose. Sends it in front. Oh, he comes up with a stop. And the puck stopper hangs on to get a breather here for the team. Inching closer to the midway mark of the period. Still scoreless in this one. Propos won the draw here in their own zone. Moves it quickly over to Richie. Read that perfectly with the poke check. Takes the feed. They've got numbers here. Handles the puck. And it was ready for that save. Goaltender covers it up. We get a whistle to slow things down. Centers are lined up, and we are ready to resume. Slides in off the wing after the centerman tied him up. The Mariners will play it from the defensive zone. Dumps it in. 
The Thunder have gained control of the puck along the wall. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Keeps control of the puck after taking a little knock. From the slot, fires away. And we get a whistle as the goaltender decides to hang on to this one. More than half the frame has been played here. We've still got zeros on the board. Adirondacks won the draw. Now let's see what they can do with it. Easily turned away by the goaltender. Sterrett's got the puck and he's going to hang on. and it's perfectly executed as he doesn't have much time to get the one-timer off, but he gets his stick available and he executes. Here in the late going to the frame, the next goal could be a big one as we are tied. Adirondacks won the draw in the neutral zone. Here's a shot! Long jam in front, that's broken up. Is stick handling in his own zone. Shot! Adirondacks got the puck inside the defensive zone. Looking to set up offensively. Shot! Off the mask of the goaltender, going right between the eyes. Well, he makes an incredible save on a point blank shot here, James. I love the way he's aggressive, he's competitive, and he wins the battle. Here's a chance! Oh, you'll win respect for your teammates doing that. What a block. Means looking to break out of their own end. Pass back to the point. Quick feed to Lambert. Aims the zone along the right wall. Fires it on net. And there's the save. Means got a hold of it along the wall. First period almost in the books here, nearing the final 60 seconds. From the blue line, they take control of it. as the goaltender will hang on and give his team a breather. Now lining up here for the face-off after a great shift there, Cheryl. Yeah, in the offensive zone, they have all the momentum. We'd be surprised to see a little stall at the face-off here to give their goaltender a little extra breather because he has been under siege, and you can see it on his face. He needs some rest. And he takes the feed. That's his first career playoff goal. Well, it is, James, and it's going to feel pretty good because there's a lot of question marks around players who can't get it done in the 
playoffs and he finds the back of the net. That's going to give him a big confidence boost to send him through the next game. This is exactly why you send bodies to the front of the net, James. You want to create a screen and the goaltender drops into the butterfly position as a default and is battling to find the puck. Can't find it and beats him clean. Maine's gone in front by a goal here in the first. Well, I really like the way they've competed here, James. They get the go-ahead goal, but they got to find a way to continue to attack. you got to play with killer instinct, especially when there's so much time left. And that concludes the first 20 minutes of play. Second period action. Stick around. We are about ready to get underway here for the second period. Second frame is underway as the puck is dropped. Well, Cheryl, we got 20 minutes under our belts in this one. How do you sum up the performance? Adirondacks had a rough start and really put themselves in some bad spots to start the game, James. And as a result, they turned over the puck. They haven't managed it. I'm telling you, their coach is not going to be happy. Puck picked up by Kyle. Gains the zone from the right. Sends the pass in front, and that's the high. And the goaltender grabs that one for a whistle to try to slow things down here. Still plenty of time left in this frame. Maine's been the better looking team over the last few minutes. They'd love to build on this one goal lead. Adirondacks got it in their own zone. And he takes the pass. Big time save on a big time shot. Moves it to Askew. And skilled use of the stick to poke the puck away. And he can't hang on after that hit. Denied by the goaltender. The Thunder have gained possession off the wall. And there's another stop. Starrett's gonna hang on for a whistle. And staying focused is key when you haven't seen a lot of work here, Cheryl. Well, as part of their mental preparation as a goaltender, even when you're not busy, you have to stay dialed in, follow the action. He's doing exactly that. He makes a nice cover. Won the face off. Quick pass to Kalmakov. The Mariners have it game. Moves it quickly over to Jordy. Carries the puck inside the neutral zone. Mains on the attack. Here he is shot in front. The Jordan's opted to hang on to the puck for a face off. the scoring opportunities they just haven't been able to capitalize as they continue to trail they take possession as he locks them up off the face off and he makes the save on that play takes a shot oh and he puts it wide of the net no and this is a near miss james you're trying to be accurate you know how good the goaltenders are and you just miss by a few inches Knowles moving the puck through his own zone moves it up through the middle from the right Big play inside the defensive zone. Josephic's taking it from his own end. Moves the puck along the half wall. That's a great heads up play to break up the pass. Kelmakov's got the puck along the wing. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Bojur's going to hang on for a whistle. Plenty of playing time left in this frame. The Mariners lead it 2-1 in what has been an entertaining game thus far. Offense is on face off and he wins the draw. Scores! And the kid comes up clutch here in the postseason. Oh, he does it, James. Gets his first playoff goal. I mean, it's incredible the confidence that this should give him. I mean, the pressure and the stakes are high and he delivers. This goal all comes down to winning the faceoff in the offensive zone, James. Everyone knows their responsibility. It's about making sure they get to the spots that they need to get to and get off a quick release shot. Great goal. Maine's now taking a two-goal lead here in the second. Well, that's a huge goal. That's going to give him a two-goal cushion. You can see the excitement on the bench right now. That's all it takes to have an impact. They put it in the net. Now they can take a deep breath and go play with creativity. Here's a short pass to Smith. Shot. Oh, he got all of that. What a save by Starrett. This is a dialed-in goaltender. Very aware. Knows where the shooter is in that low slot and makes the save. Adirondacks got the puck along the boards. 
Maine's got it in the neutral zone. The Mariners carry it along the wall. Broken up with the stick at the defensive end. Loose puck battle along the boards. Skeels got it in the defensive end. Quick feed to Smith. And a delayed penalty coming up as he got tripped up. And the players whistle dead. Here's the call. The Thunder have to serve two for tripping. in for the face-off here just moments away. It's our first opportunity to look at the power play unit here. First power play opportunity for this team. It's going to start in the face-off circle, getting possession with the win, and then looking to set up. Handles the pass. They clear the zone. Still has possession. Long reach breaks up the momentum. Puck move back to the neutral zone. Maine's got control of it now from their own end. Pass across to Kyle. Trying to get something going here with this man advantage as they start from their own end. Takes the shot. Makes the save. Smith almost ready to get back on the ice. Big stop right there. Through center along the wing. Goes right to the crease. Here's a shot. And that's blocked. Down the left wing and into the offensive zone. Here's a chance. Grabs the puck in the slot. Oh, what a stop as he uses his paddle to sweat it away. When the puck's in the low slot, the goaltender gets right out next to the shooter and makes the save. Centering feed. What a chance, but they can't connect. Moles across the line now and on the attack in the offensive end. Oh, smart heads up play to put that one away. And now it's over to Blackman. Moles got the puck in his own zone. Into the offensive end, right up the middle. Receives the pass. And he's taken down the officials arm, signaling for a penalty. And now it's Pernod. Play is stopped, and here's the official call. Well, the official was right there to make the tripping call, and it's a pretty easy one as the stick gets caught up in his opponent's skates. Another power play opportunity coming up here. They haven't scored on the power play yet, but they have another opportunity. The key to this one, gain possession so they can set up. Trying to get the puck out of his own end. Oh, and they can't get it out as they are still stuck in their own end. Yeah, and this is a tough one. Now they're fatigued, James. They had an opportunity to get it 200 feet down. Oh, what a save! Oh, that doesn't swing momentum in your favor. I don't know what will, James. That's a last-ditch effort to make a play. What a beautiful save. Such an impressive save, James. And I love to look at these ones again because it's not just being in great position. It's being desperate. It's finding a way to get to the puck, keeping your eye on it at all times, tracking it, out-battling and out-willing everyone around you. Another big face-off looming as this power play rolls on here tonight. Scoops up the puck. Takes that pass back at the point. Answers that with an even better save. That's a fantastic sequence of saves there. James, he was so dialed in, he tracked it perfectly. Here in the late goings of the period, it's a two-goal lead we're looking at with the score 3-1. They win the draw and go on the attack. Puts it on goal. Oh, misses the net. What a chance there. Oh, it was a great chance and one that he will want back. The puck is all around him, though. If he continues to get to the right spots at the right time, you got to figure he's going to book one by the Tendy. Takes the feed in the middle of the neutral zone. Richie's lugging the puck. And it's kicked away. Moves it to Kyle. Oh, textbook quick check to turn that over. Moves it around along the half wall. The Thunder have taken to the offensive attack. Made that stop. Starts. Out. What a save! It was all but in, James, and that athleticism and the will 
to get to that puck. I was on display. Quick pass to Gillespie. Here he is, wrestling on that. The lane was plugged up and that shot's blocked. And with that, two periods now in the books. Been a great night of hockey here on EA Sports, and we got the third period coming at you in moments. Welcome back, James Sabalski, ready to bring you all the play-by-play. -play. And with that, the third period is now underway. Takes it across the blue line. Uses the force on that hit. Star at slash save is one that's gonna be remembered for a while, James. It's gonna be on the highlight reel. It's on one of mine now. I mean, he stole one there. It was all but in, and that desperation and compete level, it makes the save. Oh, what a smart heads up play. Strong use of the body to force the puck loose. Make a change, Looking to make, make something change. happen along the boards. And he's knocked off the puck there. They go on the attack from the left side. Adirondack's got the puck. Great poke check on the reach. The Mariners move the puck in the defensive zone. Broken up with the stick in the defensive zone. Tries to feed it over to Josephek. Pokes the puck away. The Mariners have it from their own end. Here they come on the attack. Moves the pass in front. And that shot's blocked. Scoops up the puck here. Along the right wall and into the offensive end. Grabs possession of the puck. The Mariners scoop it up along the boards. Here they come inside the neutral zone. Mains cut it along the wall. Takes the shot. That's blocked. Great pressure on the offensive end by Kelmakov. Takes it to center. And that's snapped away in the defensive end by Richie. Mains got the puck in their own end. From along the walls, they're gaining momentum. Adirondack's got the puck. He looks deep to Smith. Moves it in front! And he shuts down a great scoring chance there! Ref blows the whistle as the puck's covered up. Still lots of time left here in this frame. The Mariners have been getting solid offensive contributions, leading 3-1. Adirondacks won the draw. And he takes the feed. And he gets just enough of it to keep it out from the back of the net. Oh, these home fans have had enough. They're wondering when a call's going the opposite way here, Cheryl. You can hear the frustration right now with that third call in a row, I might add, James. I mean, this is a one-sided game, isn't it? Unbelievable. This penalty kill will continue. Adirondacks won the draw. And they keep the pressure on. An attempt to clear the puck from deep inside his own end. And they get the puck out, and they needed that. Oh, they certainly did. This PK unit has been on fire. They get the clear. That's one. You kill valuable time. That's two. And now three. You can contest the entry. That's a great play all the way around. And a solid stop on the play there. He's been tripped up, and we got a penalty coming up here. There's the whistle. Let's get the official decision. 
You have to constantly remind yourself to move your feet and get closer to the action. You wind up reaching, you take the feet out of your opponent, and you wind up with a tripping call. As we're about to drop the puck, power play unit back out onto the ice for another opportunity. Power plays more time on the ice, the ability to get that puck moving. These players know exactly what they're doing. They work on it in practice. I spoke to some of them earlier today at the pregame, and they talked about the execution and the precision in particular with their puck movement. Stop that one. Well, he has been under siege, and I'm loving his compete level. I mean, he's making consecutive saves one after another. Reads it perfectly, breaking up the play. And they clear that puck. Adirondacks got it in their own zone. Pass it up ahead. Puts it on set. Denies him with the pad. Jostling for the puck, and he loses control. Both sides back to even strength. A great effort by the penalty killers there. Games I remember protecting a lead at the Olympic Winter Games and having to find a way to, to get that puck out and how critical it was to have good habits, be strong on the puck, and play physical. This group did a great job. That opportunity is rejected. Adirondacks got possession of the puck. Slides the puck ahead into the neutral zone. In close! Big time stop by Starrett! This shot's coming from the middle of the ice, and he hit has some heat on it, but he's ready and waiting for it. He's to position, and he makes the save. From the point, they take control of it. Oh, and he's can be tough when you're not scoring, but it's all about the now, not disrupting the flow of the game, but giving you energy. here coming up.
And a good read to get possession there with the two centermen tangled up. Look out, here they come on the attack. Makes the save. Slick feed. Shoot the puck. And we are all over with this one. Well, that's how you want to kick off a playoff series, by taking that opening win and get that momentum on your side. Well, you know, heading into the series, this is the exact game that they've been talking about that they wanted to come out on top on. It's really important to dictate play right from the onset of the series. You really want to send the message that you're here, you're here to play, and you're here to stay. That'll do it from rinkside here this evening from all of us here at EA Sports. My name is James Sabalski. Playoff hockey is simply the best, and we'll see you at the next postseason game. Cheers.